Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Microsoft Windows Enterprise Edition. Microsoft Windows Enterprise Eval Edition. Microsoft Windows Home Basic Edition. Microsoft Windows Home Premium Edition. Microsoft Windows ARM Edition. Microsoft Windows Pre-Release Edition. Microsoft Windows Professional Edition. Microsoft Windows Professional Plus Edition. Microsoft Windows Starter Edition. And Microsoft Windows Ultimate Edition. Granted, not all of those would be around forever, specifically those with pre-release in the, their title. But uh, as uncovered by my friend Tim Stevens over at Engadget, uh, apparently there may be up to nine flavors of uh, Windows 8 on the horizon. As opposed to Windows 7 with 6, now there's 8. Starter, Home Basic, Home Premium, Professional, Professional Plus, Enterprise, Enterprise, Eval, Ultimate, ARM Edition. Which one is for you? Uh, well, I would say for the most part, it's whatever Windows comes with the computer that you buy. It's just so it's so confusing. Well, I, I do they are they trying to make this more difficult than it needs to be? Now, granted, at least I can understand it. Enterprise, okay, probably not for the home user. But what's the difference between Home Basic and Home Premium, or Home Premium and Professional, or Professional Plus? And ultimate, a dizzying array of features. Why can't they just make one version of Windows and just let you buy in to the features that you want for your install? Why not do it that way? Keep it nice and affordable, one solid price point, and then just add, boom, 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 boom. You're an enterprise, fine. You can buy site licenses, boom, 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 boom. You've got one edition of Windows, but you want to add this feature, but you don't care about that feature. Fine. You don't need to buy that feature. But not with Windows 8. With Windows 8, it's 9. Well, what do you guys think? Uh, <clears throat> just the right way to go? <clears throat> you know, Do you like that variety? Uh, it, has it been clear to you in the past what the different editions can do for you and the real differences between one and another? Are you satisfied with your version of Windows and do you know that you're getting the best Windows experience as, as possible? Your computer may be able to handle an ultimate edition, yet you're on home basic. Yeah, and yes, you can upgrade. Absolutely. But it's just so confusing. It is. What is it about Microsoft that makes them want to make things more confusing than they need to be? Why? Why?